While blue is one of the most popular colors, it is one of the least appetizing. Food researchers say that when humans searched for food, they learned to avoid toxic or spoiled objects, which were often blue, black or purple. When food dyed blue is served to study subjects, they lose appetite. When countries assess their annual carbon emissions, they count up their cars and power stations, but bushfires are not included presumably because they are deemed to be events beyond human control. In Australia, Victoria alone sees several hundred thousand hectares burn each year. In both 2004 and more recently, the figure has been over one million hectares. Tesla's theoretical work formed the basis of modern alternating current electric power systems. Thomas Edison promised him almost $1 million in today's money to undertake motor and generator improvement. However, when Tesla, the ethical Serb, asked about the money, Edison's reportedly reply was, Tesla, you don't understand our American humor. The pair became arch-rivals.
The core of the problem was the immense disparity between the country's productive capacity and the ability of people to consume. Great innovations in productive techniques during and after the war raised the output of industry beyond the purchasing capacity of U.S. farmers and wage earners. Every morning, no matter how late he had been up, my father rose at 5.30, went to his study, wrote for a couple of hours, made us all breakfast, read the paper with my mother, and then went back to work for the rest of the morning. Many years passed before I realized that he did this for a living. Although it hails from a remote region of the western Himalayas, this plant now looks entirely at home on the banks of English rivers, and colonized river banks and damp woodlands. In the Himalayas the plant is held in check by various pests, but take these away and it grows and reproduces unhindered. Now it is spreading across Europe, New Zealand, Canada, and the US.
Pluto lost its official status when the International Astronomical Union downsized the solar system from nine to eight planets. Although there had been passionate debate at the General Assembly meeting in Prague about the definition of a planet, and whether Pluto met the specifications, the audience greeted the decision to exclude it with applause. At the beginning of each fiscal year funds are allocated to each state account in accordance with the university's financial plan. Funds are allocated to each account by object of expenditure. Account managers are responsible for ensuring that adequate funds are available in the appropriate object before initiating transactions to use the funds. A young man from a small provincial town, a man without independent wealth, without powerful family connections and without a university education, moves to London in the 1580s, and becomes a remarkable playwright of all time. How is an achievement of magnitude made? How does Shakespeare become Shakespeare?
Akimbo, this must be one of the odder-looking words in the language and puzzles us in part because it doesn't seem to have any relatives. What's more, it is now virtually a fossil word, until recently almost invariably found in arms akimbo, a posture in which a person stands with hands on hips and elbows sharply bent outward, one signaling impatience or hostility. Yellow is considered as the most optimistic color, yet surprisingly, people lose their tempers most often in yellow rooms and babies will cry more. The reason may be that yellow is the hardest color for eyes to take in, so it can be overpowering if overused. The elephant is the largest living land mammal. During evolution, its skeleton has greatly altered from the usual mammal, designed for two main reasons. One is to cope with the great weight of huge grinding cheek teeth and elongated tusk, making the skull particularly massive. The other is to support the enormous bulk of such a huge body.
Few things in the world produce such amazement as one's first glimpse of the Grand Canyon. It took around more than two billion years to create this vast wonder in some places. Seventeen miles wide, largely through the relentless force of the Colorado River, which runs 277 miles along its length and a mile beneath its towering rims. Global warming is defined as an increase in the average temperature of the Earth's atmosphere. This trend began in the middle of the 20th century and is one of the major environmental concerns of scientists and governmental officials worldwide. The changes in temperature result mostly from the effect of increased concentrations of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. There are perhaps three ways of looking at furniture. Some people see it as purely functional and useful, and don't bother themselves with aesthetics. Others see it as essential to civilized living and concern themselves with design and how the furniture will look in a room. In other words, function combined with aesthetics, and yet others see furniture as a form of art.
Modern buildings have to achieve certain performance requirements, at least to satisfy those of building codes, to provide a safe, healthy, and comfortable environment. However, these conditioned environments demand resources in energy and materials, which are both limited in supply, to build and operate. As a historian, if you really want to understand the sensibilities of those who lived in the past, you must be like a novelist and get into the skins of your characters and think and feel as they do. You are asked to imagine what it's like to be a peasant in medieval times, asking the sort of questions a peasant might ask. What the writer is saying is that a historian needs imaginative sympathy with ordinary people in the past. The border itself between Mexico and United States is fraught with a mix of urban and desert terrain and spans over 1,900 miles. Both the uninhabited areas of the border and urban areas are where the most drug trafficking and illegal crossings take place. Crime is prevalent in urban cities like El Paso, Texas and San Diego, California.
Networking is easy and fun because it taps into this human predilection to talk about ourselves when asked. Consider successful networking as little more than the process of guiding a person to tell you about his life, what he's doing, the company that employs him, and his current industry. Such cross-protection is usually seen between two animals. But Gore studies the same sort of mutualism in microbes. He and his team demonstrated the first experimental example of that cross-protective relationship in drug-resistant microbes, using two strains of antibiotic-resistant E. coli bacteria, one resistant to ampicillin, the other to chloramphenicol, 